Ladies and gentlemen, here it is. The moment we've all been waiting for. In this briefcase is the YouTube 10 million subscribers diamond play button. It's also kind of heavy. Before we um unbox that though, before I take it out of the briefcase, before I show you guys that, I do want to take a moment here to um just kind of say thank you guys for the past 10 years. The past 13 years, really, because I've been doing this since I was 14 and I'm 27. Man, I'm getting old. But um, as you guys probably know, yesterday we hit 10 million subscribers on the channel. And I, I'm going to try not to cry during this video. I know yesterday, I, I think I cried more yesterday on camera than I ever have in the history of the channel. I was, I was boohooing like a teenage girl who just got broken up with them prom night oh i've seen the tweets i've seen the tweets a few of you guys have asked me what it feels like to be at 10 million subs now and it feels surreal it kind of feels like i'm living in a dream right now like i'm gonna wake up at any moment i said this on stream but it's it's kind of like whenever you're a kid and you're in like second grade third grade and you know one day you're gonna graduate one day you're gonna turn 18 you're gonna become an adult you're gonna graduate high school and you're gonna move on you know you're gonna do your thing but it's so far away it feels like an insurmountable goal right that you just can't possibly imagine it like What's it going to feel like? What am I going to be like? What, gonna, what am I going to say? What am I going to do whenever that happens? And it's like, this is like that. Like, here I am. Like, I've been doing this since I was 14, since I was a kid making videos. Like, this is this has been the dream, you know? We've been on this long road, and here we are at the finish line. Like, like we did it. And I mean, looking back, it's just wild to me. You know, for the people that see my Draw My Life video, you know, I didn't really have the easiest childhood in the world right? I, I couldn't really play sports or be too physically engaged with, you know, like outside activities and stuff due to eye injuries and health issues. I was kind of a short, small, skinny, nerdy kid that kind of just stayed inside and played video games. Got bullied a lot during school, right? I, I didn't really have a lot of friends, just like a handful of people here and there, right? And then of course, growing up with a single mom, that's like its own challenge, not the, the easiest path in life. Didn't really have a lot of money growing up. The idea of going to college was was there, but because how are you going to afford it, right? College is very expensive, especially here in America. So it's like, how's that going to work? And so growing up, it was kind of just all of these thoughts in my head constantly. And then when I when I graduated high school in 2015, no no one would hire me. I couldn't I couldn't get a job. Even Walmart wouldn't hire me. They said I didn't I didn't have enough experience. I didn't have enough experience to work at Walmart. That's that's what they said. And for a few months after I graduated, it was just like, well, what am I going to do now? Am I going to be that guy that just sits in his mom's basement playing video games all day? Like, is that me? Is that what my life is going to be, right? And I remember it was a few months after graduation. It was winter break, December 2015. I started live streaming. I was bored one day. I was like, you know what? I'm going to do a Minecraft live stream. Let's let's do it. I think I had a thousand subs at the time and I started live streaming. And it was a very scary thought, right? Like the idea of live streaming. I, I didn't think I'd be good at it. I thought I would hate it. I thought people would say mean things about me, right? Because, you know, I, I do have my own insecurities. I didn't really like my voice. You know, like I, I still think my voice is a little bit weird, right? The accent, the the way I talk, very sensitive about it. You know, my eye, one eye's bigger than the other. One of my eyes are, are different colors than the other. You know, I, I thought that people would make fun of me and I just wouldn't like it. But I started live streaming and probably the best decision I ever, ever made. Started streaming and within just a few weeks, I went from 1,000 subs to 2,000 to 3,000, 4,000. And in a month or so, I, I hit 10,000 subscribers. And that's something that like, I never would have thought I'd ever hit 10,000 subs. I remember I, I ran up to my grandma's house and all my family was there and I was explaining to them, like, I just hit 10,000 subs. And they're all like, oh, that's awesome. That's amazing. But you know, like this was 10 years ago, almost 10 years ago. YouTube wasn't really that big, that mainstream then. So a lot of people didn't really know what that meant. They're like, oh, great, you hit 10,000. That's awesome, congratulations, right? And then I kept going. Months later, year later, we hit 100,000 subs. I remember getting the 100,000 play button in the mail. In fact, it, it, I have it right over there. If I zoom the camera out, you can actually see that right there is my original 100,000 plaque that YouTube sent me all those years ago. I remember I got it in the mail. I was so excited. I was sitting in my room, unboxing it, crying. I think that video is still on the channel. <laughs> I, guess, I guess I do cry a lot. Um, and then we kept going. 
Year later, a million subs. A few years after that, two, three, four, five, six. Here we are, 10 million subscribers. And it's just been such a journey. And oh my God, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm, oh my God, I'm crying again. It's just like, I never would have imagined that this is what I'd be doing, that this is what I'd, uh, this is what my life would be. You know, I, I'm very, very grateful, very, very thankful because it's like, it, with, without YouTube, I don't know what I'd be doing. I feel like everyone, whenever you're growing up, you're like, what is my life going to be? You know, because I, I know a lot of people, I'm sure everyone knows a lot of people, they have the regrets in life. They don't like their career path, or maybe they, they did something that they didn't want to do. And now they're kind of stuck there. You know, they, they wish they did something different. And it's like, I am so happy getting to do this every day. You know, yeah, it's a lot of work. Yeah. Sometimes I don't get a lot of sleep. Right. But knowing that I can make videos and and make live streams and and that those videos and live streams and all that content that, that helps people you know people come home from school and they get excited to watch my videos they get excited to watch my live streams it's a very good feeling because i remember i'd come home from middle school right didn't really have the greatest day and um i'd come home i'd be excited to check out the new yogs guest video or the new captain sparkles video i remember when captain sparkles hit 10 million subs himself, right? Like I was, I was where you're at right now on the other side of the camera, right? Listening to Captain Sparkles hit 10 million. Shoot, Markiplier, PewDiePie, all, all of them, right? And it's like now to just be in that spot, you know, like be on the other side of that is like I, a 14 year old me would be very, very, very happy, you know? Now, I don't want to turn this into too much of a rambling video. I could talk for hours about how much this means to me and how thankful I am. But I just want to say thank you to everyone. This feels incredible. It is a, a dream come true. I have never been happier. And I am so, so happy to be a YouTuber, to be a creator, to be able to make videos for all you guys. And so I just want to say thank you to everyone that's ever watched the channel, everyone that's ever watched a video. I, I get messages a lot saying that, you know, I my videos helped you through some tough times. Obviously the pandy happened. That was, that was a big thing. And just knowing that my videos are making people's lives just a little bit better. You know, my, my dumb, cringy, sometimes funny, sometimes bad videos, you know, just knowing that they, they, they help people. It's a very, very nice feeling. With that being said, I just want to say thank you one more time. And let's check out this 10 million YouTube diamond play button. <sighs> It's crazy. It comes in this giant briefcase. Get this thing unlatched. Here it is, guys. This is it. The 10 million YouTube diamond play button. It's got my fingerprints on it because <laughs> I've been, I've been holding it. Okay. I slept with it last, not like that. I shouldn't, I shouldn't have said it's, I, it was in the bed with me. I snuggled, I snuggled with it. Anyway, there it is. It's, it's heavy. I love it. It's so nice. It says on the back, Cree craft. Congratulations, 10 million subscribers. I could not be, could not be happier. Um, put it back in here. I don't want to drop it. Imagine if I dropped it and it just broke. <laughs> but thank you all so much. I remember being inspired watching Captain Sparkles, Markiplier, PewDiePie, watching their videos where they hit their goals, right? And to now be in a position where I can be that person for someone else, be that person for you guys, it's a very, very humbling position to be in. So if you're a, if you're a kid out there, if you're a teenager, shoot, if you're an adult, if you're a grandparent, doesn't matter who you are, right? You wanna be a YouTube creator, you wanna make videos, you wanna make content, whatever it is you wanna do, it's not easy. This is not an easy job. This is not an easy career right? It takes a lot of work and a lot of dedication. People always told me, you know, like, oh, you're very lucky, right? There's a little bit of luck to it. But I think at the end of the day, as with anything in life that's worth doing, right? It's hard work beats luck every single time. You just got to be willing to put in the work day in, day out. Sometimes you're not going to get a lot of sleep. Sometimes you'll miss out on fun activities. Never went to a lot of parties during high school and college, right? But after all those years, it was worth it. The hard work paid off 10 million subscribers. And, um, I just want to say thank you guys. Tomorrow, we got a brand new Roblox event. We're going to be doing a lot of streaming. We're going to be making a lot of content. We got a new Doors update coming out, new Piggy content coming out. I'm super excited. And I also got to clean up. <laughs> I also got to clean up all this mess. We got a little bit of a mess from yesterday. The, uh, the festivities went a little, little bit um, crazier than expected. But thank you guys so much. I really appreciate everything. Hope you guys have a great day. Thank you again. Million subscribers. We did it.